All right, so off to the yellow brick, brick road. road. Yep, <laughs> see? Yep. You were thinking what I yes, was Yes, I was. All we right. are in tune. Okay. Uh, Stop. And then the bird is the word. How does what? that song go? I don't you never know. Heard the bird is the word? Nope, no bird, idea. Bird, bird. The bird's the word. Bird, bird, bird. Yeah, that's like a 50 song. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I did hear it. All right. So, is it cold in this house? I'm getting cold. Yeah. I need to turn the fireplace on. Yep. Asking us to gather together all of a sudden like this, what could he possibly want? Indeed, what might await us this time? <laughs> hmm, he keeps things interesting, that's for certain. How is that funny? Can you smile like a normal person once in a while? Like how the housewife on classic TV <laughs> show smiles at the end of an episode? Really? Like housewife, uh, housewives, housewives Beverly of New Hills. York. Ooh, yay. There's something totally messed up with you if you can laugh at a time like this. Which of us is actually messed up, hmm? What's that supposed to mean? Nothing in particular, just admiring, that's all. I don't want to kill anyone, but I also don't want to stay here, living in blind denial day after day after day. I was just admiring <laughs> how you could live like that and still keep your sanity. What is this? I'm not in denial. That reminds me, remember how you kept talking about how the police or whoever would come help us? How'd that turn out? It seems to me there's no sign whatsoever of possible rescue. Well, well that's just... I wonder what actually happened. Yeah, I wonder just so much how the blue really, background could get... Strange, that's true. <laughs> what I just said was not a sentence. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way the police wouldn't know about it. We're right in the middle of a major urban area. The police suck! Uh -oh. Fuck the police. On the contrary, the master mind may be just that powerful to take control even of the police. We got a thing in the police now? A mole? Oh, this might not be related, but... Then don't say it. Hmm. Nope, gonna say it. It's about less I was near the main hall, just staring off into space, when all of a sudden, I heard it. Huh? You heard what? A sound that I don't really know what it was. What kind of sound? Well, like I said, I don't really know, but if I had to describe it, it was like a construction site, I guess? A construction site? I mean, I could just be making that up. I only just barely heard anything. <laughs> then you definitely made it up. Must just be the sound of the ocean in that head of yours. Oh, I know what he's talking about. Say, Say what? What, what, you talking what about, you're talking Toko? about, Toko? There's the fucking bear again. Oy. Oh, geez, that's actually really fucked up since I know what he's talking about. What? Nothing. Okay. You'll find out. Was he grinding someone dead? No. Microphone. Uh, all right. So what are you going to say? He's arrived. What Hero heard wasn't the sound of construction, but it could have been an explosion, huh? Or maybe a machine gun. <laughs> that can kind of sound like construction in a way. What are you talking about? Beyond this point, my mouth is zipped. My lips are sealed, and I am fully pucked. Puckered. It's a secret little secret. Fine. Then let's move on to what you can tell us. Why did you call us all here? It's Ken tell us. You got an okay. important inflection. Okay. You don't beat around the old bush, do you? Ready for me to get to the point, huh? But before that, you mind if I vent a little? I'm low on energy these days. I don't have enough energy bars. My stitching's even losing all its oh, shine God. and luster. I think it's probably become of this ho-hum, boring old everyday life. I'm looking for something with a little more stimulation. Something ripe with danger and intrigue. Listen, can I just be frank? The next Blacken hasn't shown up yet, and I'm getting bored. So I've decided to come up with a new way to motivate you. Motivate? Is it another set of videos or something? Oh. Uh-oh. Are you going to show us some demented thing to try and drive us all to murder? Drive you to murder? What a mean thing to say. Just awful. I don't know what you've got planned, but we're not going to kill each other anymore. No matter what you do, I swear to God we won't. Hmm, that's very big talk. Do your very best to back it up, okay? Now then, with your permission, let me begin. So this time it's... Embarrassing memories and secrets. As long as you're alive, it's a given that there's things you don't want other people to know about you. So I did a little investigating of my own, and I dug up some of your darkest uh -oh. secrets. Uh oh. Oh shit. Uh oh. Those embarrassing memories and secrets are all contained in the envelopes I have right here. Ooh, fancy envelopes at least. Yep. So take a second to take a peek. Ah, as Monokuma spoke, he tossed the envelopes at our feet. I quickly snatched the envelope with my name written on it, I nervously pulled out what was written inside, and my entire body suddenly went uh -oh. rigid. What? Makoto wet the bed until he was in fifth oh, grade. Big deal. Who fucking cares? Really? What? How? How'd you find out about this? Everyone started talking at once. You have twenty-four hours if someone doesn't become blackened by then. 
All your deepest, darkest, most embarrassing secrets will be exposed to the world. Good deal. Maybe I'll roll by a crowded intersection in a van strapped with loud speakers and spill the beans. Yeah, wouldn't that be so embarrassing? So that's what you meant by motivate? Yep, you got it. They're all pretty unpleasant, trust me. None of you want me to reveal that stuff, right? It's definitely something I'd rather people not know about, but you never kill over something like that. What'd you say? He's right, your plan is doomed to fail. No one's gonna murder something for this kind of thing. Oh, oh no. Is it because for better or worse, your memory is still a way to connect the outside world? I have stuff I wouldn't want anyone to know no matter what, so I assumed you'd all be the same. Which is why I put so much effort into preparing this next motive. Man, you're saying you really won't kill each other over this stuff? That just sucks. Well, what can you do? Okay, then 24 hours, I'll expose all your secrets just to make myself feel a little better. Uh-oh. So sad, so dead. depressed, fair note well. Fair not You well. are a jerk off. With an almost convincing look of depressed dejection on his face, Monokuma receded into the gym's depths. I don't know what to expect at first, but maybe we dodged a bullet on this one. I mean, yeah, having those secrets revealed is going to be totally embarrassing. But, they're ser but that's seriously not enough to give someone a reason to kill, right? Good news, everyone. I have a brilliant idea. Why don't we all just confess the secrets in those envelopes right here and now? If we do that, any and all motive for murder will vanish. That's pretty smart, right? Okay, so my embarrassing thing is... I don't want to hear your stupid story. What? Besides, I don't want to talk about it. I don't care what anyone says. I don't want to talk about mine. Neither do I. Not because it is unpleasant, but because it is impossible. Well, it's just human nature to want to hear it when you say it's impossible. Come on, it'll be good for you. Absolutely not. It's okay, just a little bit. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, uh, as I said... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I said I don't want to talk about it, you human bag of lard. <laughs> yeah? I agree with them. There's no need to discuss it. What do you think, Chihiro? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't really want to talk about it right now. But I also don't want to leave things the way they are, so maybe I can talk about it later. After I try my best to become strong, then I can tell everyone. If you don't want to talk, you don't have to. I'm not super excited to talk about it either. If everyone's that much against it, even if my bro's the one that suggested it, I gotta say no. Well, th that's okay then. Either way, it's if it's just a few secrets, I'm sure nobody's about to kill anybody over it. I hope you're right. A secret so bad you'd kill someone to keep it. Nobody's got something like that, right? Okay, I'll stop with all the secret talk, but each of us has 24 hours to get ready. Having our secrets exposed isn't going to be fun, but it's not like we're going to die because of it. So, you know, um, don't do anything hasty. The way you keep repeating it kind of makes me worry even more. Uh, oh, okay, sorry. I know it's going to be tough, but... Oh, there's oh, the big dongs here. Now, remember, everyone has different secrets, I so... I know, of course. And, and Makoto's been, like, brought up as this... As this, like, uh... I mean, he's been built up as this guy that right. doesn't really have much to hide. Nighttime already, huh? Okay, let's call. I'll call it a day. Good idea. We need to prepare for tomorrow. But I mean, everyone else here. I was left with an anxiety I just couldn't shake. But we left things as they were and left things as they lay. One by one, we headed back to our rooms. I mean, Makoto might be the odd man out. Secrets or memories really? you don't want anyone to know about. A way to connect to the outside world. Honestly, all that crop Monokuma was spouting didn't have any effect on me. There's no any way anyone would kill over stuff like that, at least that's what I thought. But maybe I was just being optimistic, which is why, probably why, without too much of a struggle, I fell asleep. Jeez, I'm more tired than usual. Super tired today. <laughs> I fell asleep. But what I didn't know is that even then a tragedy was taking oh, place. Oh no. Already, we oh, know. Great. No. Fucking awesome. Do, 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 do. Hey, there's a gun. Hey, do you have a second? I want to confide in you. It's about the prevailing world attitude right now. The difference between passive and active, I mean. For example, it's the difference between like, Oops, I killed him, and yeah, that's right, I killed him. <laughs> Amazingly, there are tons of people who don't understand the difference. Can you believe it? But there's a huge difference between oops and that's right. You know what I'm saying, right? Anyone can kill someone in the heart of the heat of the moment, but surprisingly, few can do it with calculated intent. To make that choice, then put it into action, it's way harder than just letting your emotions lead you. That's true, just like that gun in that calendar. It's all about preparation, resolve. So making maybe you're wondering, what's the point I'm trying to make? Well, I'm not totally sure myself. Maybe you should try reading between the lines. And maybe you should try reading a book about not killing people because really? you're an asshole. That's for sure. Question mark? Morning. He ain't no Ted. Good. Good morning. Good oh shit. Morning. What are you doing in my bed? What? What? Nice reaction. I'm glad to see you didn't disappoint. What? What are you doing here? I wanted to spice things up, so instead of a school announcement, I decided to wake you up in person. Wow. What the hell for? 
Because it's fun. No. And as long no. as I'm here, I figured I'd let you hear it right from the bear's mouth. Oh, hear no. what? Are you sure you should be acting that laid back? I mean, even though something happened to one of your buddy-buddy oh, classmates? Oh, God. Uh, God. What? What? Oh, no. Your face is all blue, like someone on the verge of death. What? What happened? What are you talking about? That's for me to know and you to find out. Good luck. What? Fucking asshole. Something's happened. It was... Was it? No, it can't be. There's no way someone would... But what if? No, what, what ifs are pointless, especially now when... The dining hall. I need to get to the dining hall. Yes, you do. Ugh. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Like you have a gun. Uh oh. Like Stacy's got missing. a gun. Ah, uh, Makoto. Are you okay? Hey. Did Monokuma talk to you too? Hirohina, Sakura, and that guy, Biabia. You're the only ones, ones here. here. Where's, Where's everyone, everyone else? else? Here, they're already off trying to verify what Kam Monokuma said, or they've fallen victim to the something that Monokuma mentioned. The something? It can't be. Has it happened again? Murder? After hearing what Monokuma had to say, the worst possibly forced its way into my mind. It took everything I had to drive that thought away. So, if something really did happen, does that mean someone did it because of what happened yesterday? It can't be. That stuff was just a bunch of old memories. Just old memories? Don't be so sure about that. Clearly someone felt that it was, wasn't more important than that. Huh? To judge someone else's value based on your own outlook. Do you realize how dangerous that is? That is kind of true. Really? Well, why didn't you say something yesterday? Naturally. Did you already forget? This isn't a co-op game. It's every man for himself. What good does it do me to go out of my way to help you? Stop saying that already. Uh, there's something wrong with him. For serious, did he get brandwished or something? That's not important. What matters right now is that we find out what happened. Like, it's not gonna be very tense <laughs> when you're making that noise. <laughs> voice. She's right. Let's all split up and begin looking. Hmm, the game is afoot. What? All right, so, uh... The game is afoot? Yeah. Like a... So, with a shoe uh, on it? Yes, the game is uh, literally a foot with a shoe <laughs> on it. Uh, that's still locked. So what's going on? I'm gonna go find what needs to be found. While, uh... I wanna know who died. You'll see. Do, do, do. Going over here. Going up the stairs. And going to the bears. The, the jet... The... What's, what's the... What's the baseball team? The bears? The bears is football. Okay. I think. So anyway, time What's to see that who again? died. That's the locker room. Okay. Oh shit. <gasps> Was that someone shooting someone because they went in a different locker room? Not necessarily. Girl. The door to the girls' locker room, I have no way of unlocking it, so I couldn't go in if I wanted. Huh. All right, here we go. Huh? The door's open, but aren't they supposed to be locked? Yes. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. That was gonna fuck say. again? Yeah. I have unlocked the doors, all right. It investigation? Just as I thought. Yapia, judging from what he just said, there can be no doubt a murder really has taken place. Oh, no. Come on. And the locker rooms, they're suspicious. Very suspicious indeed, wouldn't you agree? Huh, suspicious. Seems nobody searched the locker rooms. Let's start with the girls' locker room. He was muttering as if talking only to himself. Why well, start with the girls? Without waiting for a reply, he pressed his hand against the girls' locker room. And the door swung open without a sound. Oh, God. In that moment, time seemed to freeze. Oh, boy, who's dead? Oh, no. Let's see who it is. Is it a girl? <gasps> Blood. Oh, no! Oh, jeez. Well, like... she was annoying and depressed all the time. Yeah, but I mean, like... What? It's like running down her leg. What? Oh, I don't know God. how long it took for me to fully comprehend the reality of what I was looking at. But as soon as I did... She was like, Jesus. A oh, wild, no. almost primal scream escaped from my mouth. Oh, God. And that's the end of oh, daily no. life. Now we're no. on to deadly God. life. God, terrible. Yep. And, uh... Oh, my God. Is it going to let me save here? Nope. All right, so, uh, we will continue this on the next episode. And, oh, boy, uh, that's we'll, scary. we'll do the oh, investigation. Oh, my God, these girls so, are dying. I don't bye. like it. Bye.